Hi friends, I um, am coming to you today with kind of a short thrift store haul, so it won't take long. And then also wanted to let you know that I'm really excited. This isn't like some monumental milestone to many, many YouTubers or to many people, but I am thrilled to death that almost 500 subscribers on my channel. Um, been really trying to grow my channel lately and we are at 484 followers, subscribers. So um, to show my appreciation that you guys would even hit the subscribe button and care at all about what I have to say, I do want to do a giveaway, so I'm going to be talking about that in this video also. But first up, let's see what I found at the thrift store. <clears throat> okay, I've been trying not to sleep on plush. <laughs> um, and actually get some, some uh, plush items, some stuffed animals and things to resell in my store. Look at this little guy. He says, God bless America. He's a little brown teddy bear. He's so cute. Look at his little face. He's adorable. Um, this is from the petting zoo, which seems to do fairly well on eBay. He didn't seem to have any flaws or defects or anything. Probably clean him up and I don't know. I pay 50 cents for him. Maybe I can get about 10 bucks out of him. There wasn't much going on at the thrift store today, but he's cute. He came home with me. I like uh, the patriotic little sweater he's got on. And then this other guy, come on, bonus points to you. If you comment in the comments before I show his tag, where have you seen him? He's familiar. Do you know this bear? Come on, I know you know this bear. You're so cute. You know you're cute. Sorry, I don't really have a thing, weird thing with plush, I promise. But where do you know this guy from? Comment below. Five more seconds. Three, two, one. He's the Snuggle Bear from 1985. He's as old as I am. Look at that snuggle. Some things you just don't even have to look up. I'm not even sure he's making it to my eBay store. This little guy is so cute. I thought, man, I could even like decorate my laundry room with him put him up on a shelf or something and my sister is redoing her laundry room right now and I was like oh I could give her the snuggle bear she would love it and she's probably watching this all excited right now not Nicole sorry you're not redoing your laundry room but Christina and if you're watching this you're like I'm so excited but I'm sorry I don't think I am gonna give him to you <laughs> he's so cute I don't know if I'm gonna sell him or not seems to go for around 10 bucks on eBay he's got a little bit of discoloration in that eye Looks like maybe someone dropped him on the ground or beat him against the ground or something. His eyes a little scratched there. Can you see that? Yeah. So anyway, I don't know if he'll make it to my store because he's just so snuggly and adorable. And my uh, youngest, the baby, 19 month old, saw him and was like, oh, and he loved him too. So I don't know. I got him for 50 cents too. Um, I love him, love him. And then I will never not buy Vogue patterns, especially not for 50 cents. I got this uh, Victor Costa, I hope I pronounced that right. Um, Vogue pattern, Vogue dress pattern for 50 cents. Hopefully get somewhere around maybe $10 for it. Um, some of these Vogue patterns seem to be doing all right for me. I got an Yves Saint Laurent one that was a pantsuit. I got a lot of uh, watchers and views on it, but maybe I need to drop the price. Seems like some of the Vogue patterns are all over the place. You know, you'll get a couple of dollars out of them or you'll get, you know, quite a bit, substantially more than that. So this next item is pretty cool. I found it for $2 today thrift. It's this little Michael Kors pouch. Now the zipper came off there, so I thought I could either add like a really cool um, brooch or jewelry piece or something, or maybe add a tassel or something to it. Um, and then inside, let me show you what it looks like inside. Inside it says Michael Kors on the lining. It's separated by like there's a middle compartment and then there's one of these on each side. So there's actually like three compartments on the inside. It's a cute little pouch. It would make a nice pencil pouch. I thought about, um, hey, maybe I would have this for like my highlighters and stuff for my Bible things. That would be pretty cool. But then I was like, no, no, no. I should totally give this away to my subscribers, but I want to fill it with other high-end or designer or really, really super cool or vintage fashion um, I want to fill this up with stuff for you guys. Um, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to stuff this with other like vintage and thrifted designer or high-end items, whatever I can find. I mean, I'm not promising it's going to be Louis Vuitton, okay? 
Michael Kors little bag here, maybe, um, you know, throw in some designer ties, uh, some really cool vintage jewelry, something like that. I'm going to fill this up when we hit 500 subscribers. I'm going to randomly pick a subscriber just to say thank you to you guys and send this off to somebody for a new home. So uh, if you want your friends, uh, if it sounds like something they might be interested in, definitely tell them to subscribe. Um, and yeah, I'm going to get to filling this up this weekend. I'll let you guys know before I send it off what all ended up being in it. So it's kind of like a mystery bag. Super cool. If you're a reseller, maybe there's some stuff in here that you'll be able to resell. Um, and so I can't wait to tell you guys. I'm, maybe I'll do like a haul video of what all is in the bag when I give away the bag. It'll be so cool. So a little Michael Kors bag. Um, that's all for my haul today. And I just want to let you know, again, the only thing that you have to do is subscribe to the channel and when we hit 500 subscribers i'm going to give it away um i'm 484 right now and uh i thank you guys a whole lot for that so um i hope you enjoyed the thrift haul today as always god bless